Hey everybody, it's me Daniele. I just wanted to actually report back on the Self Magazine Workout in the Park event that I attended in New York. Um, it was actually in Central Park and uh, it did rain a little bit the morning of but by the time I got there it was already gone. The rain stopped and um, it was a pretty nice event. A lot, a lot of people went, mostly all women. Um, I saw probably five guys that were not on staff. Um, either probably going with their girlfriends or just going there for, you know, to have fun. And um, it was cool, kind of fun to watch them, you know, dance out there and uh, take part in some of the classes. Um, I will say that I did not get a chance to book a class with uh, Mandy Inberg. Her class actually got booked before I got there. And um, the good thing was that I was actually able to meet her. She was so nice. She let me take a picture with her. Um, I even bought I bought her new yoga philosophy DVD. Um, I practice yoga on my own sometimes, and I've taken a few classes, um, you, you know, so I did need to ask her what kind of level was it? Was it beginner? intermediate advanced and she said it's kind of a mix you know so if you're a beginner you could still learn and you know if you're advanced or intermediate it's still good it's still challenging so I said what the heck I bought the DVD it was twenty dollars at the event and I think it's normally thirty um, and then I picked up these other cards from her table and uh, one of the cool things was that by the time I got home you know, I had so many stuff. They were giving away, like, samples of soy milk. I tried chocolate soy milk for the first time. I never even had regular plain soy milk, so that was a huge thing for me. Um, we got soy snack bars, uh, almonds, all tons of samples out there. But, um, yeah, so I was going through everything. I saw this this morning pretty interesting um, it actually talks about creating your own vision mat and um, ooh, look wearing my red carpet ready shirt um, but yeah if you know Val is very big on creating your own vision board and with this Mandy Inberg teamed up with yogamatic.com and it tells you how you can make your own vision mat and it's pretty similar it starts with making your own vision board, you know, collage of words, pictures, anything uh, detailing your dreams and goals in life. And you're going to make sure that you can put the vision board in a place that you could see it on a daily basis. And really the vision mat is kind of like the ideal solution. So you send all the pictures uh, directly to yogamatic.com. You know, you, I'm trying to read the details here, or you could call them as well, but uh, you could actually create your own vision mat, and the picture is right here, if you could see it. So on a huge, big yoga mat, you'll have all your pictures from your vision board, and I thought that was pretty cool. Um, I have no clue how much it is. I haven't gone online to check yet, but if you're interested, you know, that might be pretty cool, so check it out. Um... Yeah, uh, another cool thing, I won a yoga mat, I mean, not a vision board mat, but uh, nonetheless, pretty cool, and um, you know, I did a lot, a lot of walking that day, um, it was a good exercise overall, I took a few classes, even got a little mini facial um, with Garnier, trying Garnier products, and uh, we got to try the zero gravity chairs. I must get one of those. Um, delightful. So another note is I thought of Nair to Joy when I got to the park. Actually beforehand because I put on my sunblock. I made sure that I carried a jacket with me. Um, you know just in case it was way too sunny. I'm least protecting my arms and you know I had I didn't have a chance to apply sunblock, which 
I mean, it's not that bad. I have my jacket covering me, but at least I also had a hat. So, you know, try trying to take care of my skin, and um, overall, the food was pretty healthy there too. They, we had uh, the VIP ticket, so we were provided a lunch, and I chose a tuna sandwich, and it came with tuna fish, a little bit of light mayo, um, spinach, and the seven grain wheat bread. Um, I'm not going to lie, I never had raw spin spinach. I had spinach a few times in my life and it's always been cooked or um, blended into a green smoothie. So it was a really weird yet new experience for me to have raw spinach in my sandwich. But um, it was still yummy. So uh, I hope you like the recap. One thing I want to leave you at, leave you with is if you like my little headband, uh, well if you don't know me then you know, one thing you'll learn is I love getting head headbands. Um, use them all the time, whether at the gym. Sometimes, you know, I just like using them for the heck of it. But um, yeah, they were sell selling these airy headboards at the headband. Sorry, at the event, and uh, they're pretty cute. So, you know, I got one of those. Um, but yeah, enough talking. Uh, just hope you enjoyed this little video recap and um, stay red carpet ready. All right, bye.